So yesterday I put up a video talking about pancake batter, uh, saying how you shouldn't over mix it and you want it to be lumpy. Um, I was talking specifically about the American style sort of fluffy pancakes that I was making. With those pancakes and any pancake that you have baking powder in, you want to leave them under mixed uh, so that, first of all, you don't develop too much gluten so that they don't come out too tough, uh, and so you don't beat too much air out of them so that they stay fluffy. With something like a crepe, or say like a British style really thin pancake, one that doesn't have baking powder in it, or one that is meant to be very thin, uh, you can actually beat those much smoother. Um, with a crepe especially, you want to beat it much smoother because first of all, you don't want a lot of bubbles in there. You want it to stay nice and flat. You want tiny little micro bubbles maybe, but not any of those big bubbles. Um, and you certainly don't want lumps in the batter there. Um, with the crepe as well, you want it to have a little bit of elasticity to have a little bit of stretch and pull uh, so that you can wrap it around fillings or roll it. Uh, so that's why it's okay to mix crepe batter or even to put it in a blender and let it rest overnight.